Here, some questions are given in column 1 and the corresponding answers are given in column 2 and we need to match them. Question A says that there are three vectors A bar, B bar and C bar which form a triangle as shown. We need to find the internal angle between the triangle A bar and B bar which is theta. We can find the angle between A bar and B bar by using the dot product which is pi minus theta that is cos of pi minus theta is equal to A bar dot B bar divided by mod A into mod B which is equal to minus 1 plus 3 divided by root 4 into root 4 which is equal to 1 by 2 which is equal to cos of pi by 3 in the interval 0 to pi. Therefore, we have pi minus theta is equal to pi by 3 which implies that theta is equal to 2 pi by 3 which is option Q. Question B can be rewritten as integral a to b f of x minus 3 into integral a to b x dx which is again equal to integral a to b f of x minus 3 into b square minus a square by 2 which is equal to the RHS which is a square minus b square. Rearranging this we get integral a to b f of x dx is equal to b square minus a square divided by 2. Now this is possible only if f of x is equal to x. Therefore f of pi by 6 is equal to pi by 6 which is option P. In option C, since we know that integral of secant x dx can be written as ln of secant x plus tan x plus c. So the integral can be rewritten as i is equal to pi square by ln 3 into ln of secant pi x plus tan pi x from the limits 7 by 6 to 5 by 6 divided by pi which can be expanded to pi by ln 3 into ln of secant 5 pi by 6 plus tan 5 pi by 6 minus ln of secant 7 pi by 6 plus tan of 7 pi by 6 which is equal to pi by ln 3 into ln of mod 3 by root 3 minus ln of 1 by root 3 which is equal to pi therefore the answer is s In question D, let u be 1 by 1 minus z. And after rearranging, we get z as 1 minus 1 by u. Now we are given mod z is equal to 1. That is mod of 1 minus 1 by u is equal to 1. That is mod of u minus 1 is equal to mod of u. Which can also be equal to mod of u minus 0. That is, the locus of u is a perpendicular bisector of line segment joining 0 and 1. And we can see that the argument of u will approach to pi by 2 as u tends to infinity but will never touch pi by 2 because z is not equal to 1 and u cannot be infinity. Therefore, theta max will be pi by 2. So, the answer for question D is T.